What's up? This is Quar2448 with Video. Today we'll be doing some camping here in GTA 5. We'll be bringing with us the old RV and we'll be using the 2015 Ford F-150 with a utility trailer to bring our two-seater Polaris RZR over to the campsite. And we will be camping in the mountains, which should be a lot of fun. So we'll be first loading up the Ford F-150 with a utility trailer. The Ford, the Polaris, and the trailer is a pretty cool mod. And as you guys see this is one very cool first person view so we're going to pull forward here we do not want to go all the way into this street but that looks to be good and as you guys can see we do actually have a pretty cool character so we'll be kind of hopping into this Polaris I'm very excited for camping here in GTA 5 we'll be doing a few more GTA 5 videos and I really do enjoy this game it's a pretty cool game and all of the GTA 5 videos featured on the channel are PG-13 all ages are allowed to watch it so as you guys can see we'll kind of load up here very slowly this is one very cool kind of car trailer mod. It works awesome for us uh, two-seater players, and it's pretty easy. It doesn't even need a ramp on the back since it's pretty low to the ground. So as you guys can see, we got that loaded up, and that looks awesome on the back. So this is pretty much some camping and some trail riding combined for some awesome uh, camping. So we'll kind of pull forward here. It looks like the players will move around just a little bit on the trailer. We'll be heading out from our house here with the F-150, and I really do like this truck. I've been trying to find a lot of different trucks here in GTA 5 that will allow the hitch and we might do some Ford Raptor and some Ram Rebel videos. So let me know down below in the comments if we should do those. I really do like featuring different games here on the channel. We'll be taking this right up here at the intersection, and I really do like the look of this Ford F-150. It looks like it has the STX package on it because of those wheels, and I really do like it in ruby red, which is pretty cool. We'll wait for this old uh, off-road vehicle to kind of go by, then we'll be going, and I really do like this trailer. It looks like the wheel is scraping on the ground just a little bit, and the F-150 looks like it is not even squatting, which is pretty cool. And then on the inside, you guys can see this is one very nice, very detailed Ford and it looks like it's the older Ford interior so that might need to be upgraded but I really do like the modded vehicles here in GTA 5 they are very realistic and do have a lot of detail so as you guys can see we are kind of cruising here on the highway I'm driving as carefully as we can making sure that we will not be losing that two-seater Polaris but this Ford F-150 is doing a pretty good job hauling in. it looks like somebody is trying to pass us but here we are we have arrived here at the campgrounds area once this uh, lifted truck goes by we'll be making the turn and let me know down below in the comments if we should do some uh, pretty realistic off-roading videos I really would like to feature maybe more GTA 5 here on the channel and it does look like the Polaris is just about to fall off so hopefully we can find a pretty good area to camp I'm thinking we'll probably come right over here to the uh, left but we'll be going down this dirt road just a little bit then we'll be setting up I think we'll kind of go right over here to the right right next to this rock but take a look at that guys we have arrived here at our our campgrounds very very exciting and now we'll have to switch back and go get our RV but take a look at that the players did move around a lot as we were making our way over here but we'll kind of hop in this and we'll be unloading this right now and I did actually have to stop a few times to put it back on the trailer but overall I'm very excited for using it today it's brand new to us and it looks pretty cool with that LED light bar on the top and everything like that so we'll kind of get this parked up right over here and we'll select back over and hop in the RV we have arrived back here at the house. We'll be hopping into this RV, and I really do like this. This is a pretty realistic RV, and this is the in-game one. And a few months ago, we did do a uh, RV camping video here in GTA 5 with a pretty cool modded one. But take a look at this. You guys can see it's a very wide camper, pretty realistic, and overall, this looks awesome. And on the inside view, I mean, this looks pretty cool, and I really do enjoy doing daily videos here on the channel, and I appreciate all of the continued support. So as you guys can see, see we are making our way over there and I really do like this RV looks like we are going 15 miles per hour that's pretty fast and I mean it's awesome and this overall looks pretty cool so we'll be taking this onto the dirt roads hopefully we do not run into any problems kind of driving and potentially getting ourselves stuck but once we get over there we'll be hopping into the players once we get the campsite set up and we'll be going out onto the trails which should be very exciting I really do like that it's a very cool model and it looks overall awesome and if you guys would like to see more GTA 5 videos let me know down below in the comments if we should do some off-roading with some lifted modded trucks something cool like 
like that, I think would be awesome for us. So as you guys can see, we're just about arriving back here. And I mean, this is one pretty cool camping area. It's kind of at the bottom of a mountain. And it looks like we are just going to have to wait a few more vehicles to pass by. I do not really want to kind of go when there are very large vehicles kind of going. And it looks like we should be able to go. There's just enough room. We'll kind of turn and we'll wait. It looks like uh, we'll kind of go right before this minivan comes. And take a look at that. We have pulled onto the dirt road. You guys can see Mount Chiliad Tourist Trail. So, I mean, this is pretty cool. You guys can see there is some tourists walking by, which is awesome. And like I was saying earlier, all of my GTA 5 videos featured here on the channel can be watched by all ages. I really do strive to make videos age appropriate for everybody to watch. And as you guys can see, we have arrived here. It looks like the trailer did despawn. I do not know exactly how to save the trailer from not doing that, but I really do like that. So as you guys can see, we got the RV here. We got the Polaris and the Ford F-150. Very cool camping setup. Now we'll be hopping into the Polaris RZ. It looks like this is the 1000 model. This looks pretty cool. And we'll We'll kind of a head out here and take a look at this first person view pretty realistic but now it's time for us to have some fun since we arrived here at our campsite and I really do like the off-roading in this game a lot pretty realistic so we'll kind of be going over here and we'll kind of go off the trails kind of have some fun and there should be like a mountain trail all the way to the top of that mountain not sure if we want to go all the way up that today but as you guys can see we are riding this trail and I think we'll have to let's take a look looks like a uh, there's really no trails over there, so we'll kind of continue this one and see how this does, but there should be a few others for us. Looks like we are just about tipping this very fast. Wow, almost losing control there. These are very hard turns. Wow, there we go, guys, and we roll this over. But take a look at that, guys. We got it back on all four wheels just by turning the wheels in one direction. But these are some pretty cool, fun trails. I really do like these a lot. Pretty challenging, very narrow bridge, and very fast Polaris. But I think we'll kind of turn around here and we'll head back since uh, this kind of goes into the town. And we want to kind of stay away from the town since we are camping and enjoying a pretty nice day out here in GTA 5 on Mount Chiliad. Very challenging train, and I mean, this has good turning though, which is pretty helpful. And I mean, there's a pretty large cliff on the side, which goes down to the road, so we do not want to crash down there. And we are actually getting a lot of momentum, a lot of speed, kind of going through these trails, which is a lot of fun. Looks like we just got a little bit of air, and maybe there is a jump coming up, something cool we could do, but we're we'll gonna turn, and there we go, guys. We rolled it over, just could not turn there. But I think we'll kind of go over here to the left just a little bit. There should be a little bit of uh, trails, and then we'll call it a day. Yeah, it looks like there are some trails in front of us. We'll be making our way over there. Looks like we'll be crossing another bridge, and that looks to be like a pretty cool logging area over here. And I think uh, we'll kind of go up this trail. Wow, take a look at that. Looks like this could be the start to a trail. And it looks like it is, so you guys can see a lot of trail riding today with this uh, two-seater Polaris, and there we go, guys. This roll cage really does save us, especially when we're rolling over at very fast speeds. And hope you guys are having a great day today. Let me know how it is down below in the comments. I really do enjoy da doing daily videos and featuring different videos like this one here on the channel. So as you guys can see, it looks like there is a trail over here. We'll probably just go to the top of this section. Then we'll pretty much call it a day. But like I was saying, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. And subscribe for more.